Hey everyone, it's me, Vision. Welcome back to the tutorial. In part four, we will be focusing on the challenges. Now, I did create a poll what you guys wanted next, and you guys said that you wanted uh, how to make the NPC move around, but I'm not very good at that. I do know how to do it, but I'm not very good at explaining it. So, in the description, I left a, another tutorial video that I tested out, and it works just fine in June 2020. So go watch that video. I'll give credit to him in the description. But when you do that, you want to make sure all of these parts here are unanchored. Um, so your NPC can move properly. So yeah, go to the link in the description and do that. Also, if you want the moving to be timed, I recommend inserting a script um, inside of, of like, let's just say this is the script where you're going to make him go from point to point. Let's say you want him to wait for 60 seconds and then he can start moving to points that's what you would do so if um, you're gonna do that with the video will be in the description you're gonna have to time it correctly um, inside the script but anyways today we will be focusing on challenges so I already put it some seats in because I will be doing a sit challenge so after the dialogue um, we're going to do our challenge one. So I'm going to just create this. So I'm going to copy this and paste it in here. So local, and then we're going to make them say, "It's hold on. It's getting late. Everyone, please find a tent to sleep in for the night." And then wait for about seven seconds. And we will do a timer event. And we're gonna fire it to all clients. And then we will do, hold on. Let me make sure I have this correctly. Okay, fire our clients. Um, we'll give them 10 seconds. Then we'll wait for 10 seconds, and then after that, we'll do, um, I hope everyone chose wisely, I'll just say, <laughs> I hope everyone chose wisely. Alright, so now if we want to make this work, we're going to have to add in some special parts up here in challenge one. Okay, so at the top of challenge one, you want to paste in this, link in the description, I will have it. So this will be a check if players sit. So if they do not sit, then their health will go to zero and they will die. So make sure um, at the end you do check if players sit. If you do not have this, then even if the player doesn't sit, they will still be alive. So make sure. 100% that you have this in because you like the player will still be alive if this doesn't happen So now let's test it out. Hello everyone welcome to the circus Wow this place is incredible Go ahead and take some time to look around so this is the other timer that we did the last episode, but this this one doesn't kill you because it's not a challenge. It's just l a little free time that you have. So I hope you all enjoyed this wonderful circus. And then he will say, it's getting late. Come back to the tents, please. So then now the uh, transition will start. And then we will be put down here. It's getting late. Everyone, please find a tent to sleep in for the night. So, for the sake of the tutorial, I'm not going to sit in a tent. So, I can show you that you should die if you do not sit in a tent. Actually, these are the only seats that are available. Since I don't, I don't need a lot. It's just for tests. So yeah. As you can see, I have died. And the dialogue started after the timer. So, yeah. That is part four. I'm very sorry. Um, I just said sorry. I'm very sorry it was short, I don't have a lot of time to film, but again, if you want to make your NPC move, go to the link in the description um, to another person's YouTube video, I will give credit to them. 
But for the sake of my tutorial series, I will not have my NPC move. I would just have him disappear or something like that. See ya guys. See you later.